Hey, our students. So we are looking at the art of Wayne Theobald, who loved pastries, loved cakes, loved cupcakes, loved donuts. He loved painting them all, and who wouldn't? So we are going to first practice again drawing a cylinder. We'll go step by step how to do that and give you a little bit of practice time. And then we are going to design our own pastry shop window. Now that can be with one cake that you can design or you can do a window full of different types of cakes. Um, it's a great opportunity to practice your greedy shape drawing, your decorating, and your color use. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, students, so we are going to start off uh, practicing drawing cylinders before we start our Wayne Theobald cake design. So let's go over that real quick and I want you to follow along with me. We're gonna do just five, okay? And I'm gonna start off with an oval. All right, we draw two lines down. And then we're not gonna draw another oval here. We're just gonna draw a curved line. Let me re remind you some of the mistakes that people make. People sometimes draw their oval and then do something like this. No, nope, we don't want that. Nope. Uh, or you might do this where you draw the line down and then you draw a straight line across. This is also, you don't want that, okay? You wanna make sure that this line is curved, okay? Just like this. So I'm gonna do this five times so I remember how to do this. Now, I'm not doing this here, I'll sh but you should draw with a whisper line, you know, kind of light. So if you make mistakes, it's easy to erase. That's one thing you'll need is an eraser in case you need to make mistakes. Mine has a little bit of an eraser. Could probably use something better. Let's see if I can find a better eraser than what I have. Um, here, I have one of these pencils here that has a really good eraser. I'll use this. Okay, so in case I need to fix any errors, I have an eraser right here. Um, two lines down and curved. All right. That curve here should match as best as possible. Remember, this is just practice. If you mess up, if you want to do more than five, that's okay. Uh, that might be helpful to get your mind in the right spot. Okay, now this is again a cylinder, like a can, or in this case, a cake. All right, so let's get, this is my practice. Hopefully you did that and you did all right. Now we are going to do a Wayne Theobald cake and we'll have different examples of cakes that you can look at. You can look, I'll have something that you can use to uh, come up with your own decorations, but I'm gonna, you can make either more than one cake and maybe I'll do, you could do like a, I'll do an example here. You could do, you could draw like a window that has one, that has maybe like, three cakes. We're going to imagine that we are decorating a baker's window and you can do, if you're making them small, I recommend that you do more than one. All right. And then I will draw a plate that they are sitting on. And then maybe I'll put like a little line here for a shelf. All right. And then I'm going to draw another one. Now, uh, you might want to make your line a little bit darker.
Now, now you're gonna decorate your cake. You're gonna come up with different things that you could put on the top and on the side. So I might do kind of a bumpy line. This is where we use our lines and we use our uh, shapes here to decorate. Like I might have something like a round triangle to decorate it on the top of the cake. I might make a kind of a star shape. Not exactly a star, but something similar with some dots here. You'll color those in later. And then maybe I'll just make some lines. Now, if you make some lines, you gotta make them curve around too. All right, and then maybe I'll, let's see, what could be a little bit different? I can make sort of a diamond shape here and maybe I make a oval, a circle in the middle. And then, let's see, I'll make some triangly shapes outside here. Maybe make another star here. All right, now I might make a swirl in here, like a, for this one. This is gonna go around like that. And then maybe I'm gonna make sort of like a water shape going around here. And this is fun, you can make your own patterns. No one can tell you no. All right, now I would color this in, but I'm gonna do another one, a big one. And I'm gonna color that one in so you can get some ideas of the shape. This one I'm gonna leave out. Um, maybe I'll put a picture of it. Maybe I'll color it later and put it on the, the slideshow so you can see what colors I choose for it. But I'm gonna pull that aside because I'm gonna make just one big one. Now I have to, I'm gonna draw my whisper lines, my whisper drawing, so if I make any mistakes, I can fix it. And I'm gonna draw those two lines down, making a giant old cake here. I'm gonna make a curved line. Then this is also in the window. This is in the baker's window. Wayne Theobald liked to pretend that they were baker's windows and put them on plates and make them look like they were for sale. Now we gotta make these cakes as pretty as possible because we want people to buy them. Uh, okay, so now I have my basic shape. I'm gonna go ahead and make the lines darker. Now that I'm satisfied with those lines. I can still go back and erase though. All right, so I'm gonna do some of the designs I did for the other one. I'm gonna make a, um, actually I'm gonna start in the middle. I'm gonna put a little oval in the middle and then I'm gonna draw a line out. And again, you can make your own designs. You can come up, you can use some of mine. You can be inspired by Wayne Theobald in your cake designs and any of the examples I'm showing you. Uh, or you can use, you can make up your own, all right. And if you get done early, make another one. There's always room for more. And I kind of like a little wavy this. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and color and you can see what I come up with. So I'm gonna go ahead and speed this up so you can see the colors I choose. So there's my Wayne Theobald cake. Uh, again, if you're gonna make them smaller, I suggest putting more than one in your uh, cake window. Uh, this would be colored later. Uh, so hopefully I can get that done, I can show you. But if I don't, uh, this is one thing you can do. Here's my full cake color. You wanna make sure you use the whole space and I look forward to seeing what you do. Have fun.